Before I comment anything for this video, let's watch this video together. I think that is where you are lacking and you could do better. So I ordered a burger and the first error they made was microwaving a burger. Usually, burgers are not pre-made, it's a la carte, meaning you make it as the place and order. I already saw the burger I made and I was like, mm, I'm curious, let me see how a ready-made burger tastes like. And when I placed the order, I saw them put it in the microwave. You do not microwave pastries. First of all, again, when they order a burger, you make the burger a la carte. But let's assume the burger was already made. If you want to warm it, you put it in a oven, in an oven that's already hot for three to five minutes. Imagine you went there, you stand, they look there when they microwave the food, then they microwave the, the burger, and you still come back, constantly use and they do content. Does it even make any sense? And you call yourself a food but reviewer. But then again, you are not meant to warm burgers. You are meant to make it a la carte. And your other pastries that were also pre-made, when I ordered the, is it bread cake? I don't know what that is. They also put it in the microwave. And I would assume that they put your other pastries in the microwave. Your bread cake, I am not trying to be funny. If I stoned someone that your bread cake, the person would have a migraine. Now, I'm sure that when the bread cake was made fresh, it probably tasted nice and it had a soft, fluffy texture. But microwaving pastries makes the texture hard and turns it to stone. So I would strongly advise that you either make some pastries a la carte or you get that heated lamp that keeps the food warm when it's in the show glass. And if you can't do that and you want to warm the food, I would strongly advise you put it in the oven. Except your pastries. Everything else in the restaurants was standard. The service was good. The local dishes look nice. But your pastry chef needs to be taught one or two things. Again, I come in peace. I know this review. How, how, person, how, how will you reasonable someone? Take his own leg, come off of where they live, go another man's state, go this point in business for her. Who does that? Nobody say they invite you, nobody say they say me, you come. Nobody say they say me, they write you letters and say, okay, come, come and review our food for us. They don't beg you, they don't, you don't do any ambassadorship deal for with them. You come to live in your own place, go another man's state, go this point in business. This is between uh, Okoye Mifashakin and um, Kubana Chief Priest. Eh? You leave Lagos, come this point that man's business. If that man take that thing now, legal now, he go be like, say, the man don't do bad. He don't use him money because of saying he get money, he get influence. He gonna use some variety guy. Now, see what, see what, see what, see what the poor man like, like me. Let's see what the poor man, the poor, the, see what the poor man is doing to another rich man. Because of what? You call yourself a food reviewer, a food tester. Just test what you want test. Review what you want review, honestly. Eh? Meanwhile, I tell them, say me, they do this thing. Now, see they come back, they say, yeah, you know, don't you send them. Say, the thing they do now, rubbish. Why you go to a rubbish person? business now. That man even politely go in comment session. Go the guy that that was in fashion. The man carry himself. Kubana Shikri carry himself to that guy's page. He commented like a honest comment that thank you for coming. We really appreciate the comments. Not knowing that the guy even have bad mind for him with, with, with the food. With the food they serve. Imagine you went there, you stand, they look there when they microwave the food. They microwave the, the burger and you still come back constantly using the content. It doesn't even make any sense. And you call yourself a food reviewer. You call yourself a honest food reviewer. Are you a food reviewer like that or you are, you are just a cloud chaser? And look at what the guy did now. That is why Nigeria is not growing anywhere. We are not even growing anywhere. We are not helping ourselves. Eh? Just be honest with everything you are doing. Don't, 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 be, don't be cloud chaser because you want to get reviews, you want to get engagements. You are now... Okay, now you are, you are trending. That's what you want. Yeah, that's it now. You are spending some of this business. If that man take it later now and he, he decides to use police to arrest the man uh, of that opinion for shaking, they will they blame the man and say that he used his own influence, he used his money, if they use the right then poor, poor person. Then, okay, if so you look at look at it now, are we not the one doing ourselves in this country? How does that even make sense? Does that even make any sense at all? Then you use your own, you want one, ah, you carry this your my gun leg, you carry your come up for Lagos, you go in most states, go to spoil another man's business. Eh? If he is you said do your own now. Easy, do your use do your own. Make people come to test your food because not only you want perfect, you are the perfect person, most, most, most good person, the great, the greatest. Senior man, I hate you.